The alternating dumbbell bent over row is a really good way to teach the shoulders to twist and give the hips some stimulus to stay still. So we're gonna start with the weights elevated on a bench or a chair. You're gonna do a nice RDL, push through the legs like a normal <laughs> lower body rep to pick that up because we don't want any little accidents to happen. Uh, and now to set up for this one, we have to be able to do an RDL. So we're pushing the butt back and up. I'm feeling a lot of load in the legs, not a lot of load in the back. Okay, even though I'm bent over, I shouldn't feel a lot of load in the back. You wanna place it all in the legs. And now for alternating, I'm gonna go one arm up. Let that shoulder twist backwards slightly. I don't want the hips to go with it. I just want the shoulder to go. I don't need to force it too much, but let it happen. And then we're just gonna alternate sides. I don't like to be in this bent over position for very long, so I try to move with authority on this one. If I'm gonna do this one wrong, the thing that I see the most is just people are not as stable at the hips as they think they are, and they row something like this. Now, when you do it that way, you're definitely gonna feel your low back doing the work. Make sure you keep the hips nice and still and let the shoulders turn.